Hi, I'm Ken Russo, a sales engineer here at Epitronics. Today I'm going to take you behind the scenes for a live test with our 800 PLDC series DC Digital HiPod testers. Here at Epitronics, we always stress the importance of safety. Be sure to follow your company's protocols and regulations for personal protective equipment and safety guidelines. This model is our 880 PL Digital HiPod tester. Other models in the 800 PL series follow a similar testing procedure, but today I'm going to demonstrate use on a 15 kV class cable. While the power is off, connect your AC power supply to the unit. This unit is equipped with universal mains capabilities, so external transformers aren't necessary if you use a standard outlet. Power on the unit with the rocker switch. It'll finish its boot sequence in a few seconds. A warning screen will pop up, reminding you to connect a safety ground from the ground stud. Press OK when you're sure. On the main menu, we see automatic mode, manual mode, test reports, and settings. Today I'm going to run my tests in automatic mode and then manual mode. But first, let's take a look at our settings. The settings menu lets you preset your target voltage, dwell timer, max leakage current, and ramp rate in automatic mode. General settings of the unit can be adjusted here, such as language, unit information, screen brightness, as well as other capabilities. Press the home button to go back to the main menu. I'm going to get ready to run my test in automatic mode. First and foremost, connect your safety earth ground to the device. This should be the first cord connected and the last one disconnected. Then, connect your high voltage output cord to the conductor of your cable. And finally, connect your return lead first to the machine and then to your device under test, or DUT. To connect your interlock safety device, locate the red dot at the base of the plug and then line it up with the receptacle next to the padlock symbol. When the interlock plug is properly inserted, the warning symbol will disappear from the touchscreen. The e-stop warning symbol will disappear when the e-stop is twisted clockwise. Now you're ready to begin your test. But before I press start, I'm going to double check my target voltage, my ramp rate, my max leakage current, and my dwell time. I'm also going to take note that I have no interlock open icons and then press start. You can see in real time your voltage and your current displayed in either digital or analog style meters. Once your target voltage is reached, your dwell timer will automatically begin counting down. When the timer runs out, the 880PL-DC will automatically bleed off voltage to ground. But to make sure that the device is safe, I'm going to go ahead and use a grounding stick, just for safety. This is a step that we recommend doing for any and all high voltage testing. You can dismiss the standard message by pressing OK, or you can save the data in a report by pressing the Save button. In manual mode, targets are still set by the user but the ramp rate is controlled manually. You can still input your target voltage and max leakage current as normal, but once your test is live, you control the voltage manually with either the rotary knob or the arrows on the screen. This is particularly useful if your test requires step voltages. Just like in automatic mode, the same test complete or DUT breakdown box will come up. You can either clear it out with the OK button or press save. I'm going to save it so that I can see my report later on. And then I'm going to click OK to confirm. And then go back to the home screen. 
If we select Reports from the main menu, we can see the previous tests arranged by time. Let's look at a recent test. The data is displayed as a graph showing voltage, current, and resistance with respect to time. Each of these values can be toggled from the bottom of the screen. To extract data from the 880PL DC high pot, insert a flash drive into the front of the unit and press Export to USB button on the screen. Now that I've finished my test, I can pack up my 880PL-DC. And move on to my next job. Thanks for watching today's video. For more videos, be sure to check out our YouTube channel. For product information and to request a quote, be sure to visit our website. For any other inquiries, contact your local representative. Thanks for watching.